Hey, it's just T with another Feel Good Factor segment. Uh, this is going to be entitled Five Reasons to Plank. Remember that craze where planking was supposedly cool? She did it in random places. I remember I doing it in the, uh, the Guinness factory. Completely random. But I'm talking about the exercise to plank. Why the exercise to plank is going to be so important for you to work on five different things. So the first reason is obviously to flatten your stomach. So the more and more you plank, the more and more your muscles, that's your muscles in your core, as well as your abdominals, also work to tighten and work to burn fat in that target area. So the area that you're targeting, if it's your stomach, the plank is an ideal exercise for that. So it's not just about crunches, it's not about a blip twist, it is about that plank, that plank is gonna hold everything together. So it is a great reason to plank. Secondly, to reduce the risk of injury. Now, believe it or not, muscles always work in pairs. Okay, so obviously your biceps and your triceps work together, your deltoids and your trapezius, which is the triangle muscle in your back, starting here, that also works together, your quads and your hamstrings work together, and your lower back and your core, so it's your abdominals, work together. So the stronger your core, the less likely you are to get back injuries. Now I know a lot of you sit with roundy shoulders at work, put so much pressure on your shoulders and your back, lower back, so the better your core is, the better it is for you as a person, especially when you're exercising. Like me, personally, I'm sat on my bow suit ball now doing this because it's strengthening my core. Okay, number three, it's an exercise you can do absolutely anywhere, all right? It's an exercise on the go. You can do five sets of 30 seconds on any surface, any flat surface you want, you can do it. If you're in your bedroom before work, you can do it in the office. People look a bit weird, but you can do it. Anywhere at all, out on the street, on the train, on the, on the bus, anywhere you can do it. Let's start a challenge. So I'm gonna start a challenge after this video, but I'm gonna talk about it a little bit later on, okay? So it's an exercise you can do absolutely anywhere at all, even on holiday, anywhere at all, okay? It improves your posture. Now, the stronger your core is, everything then sits upright. So your stomach tucks in, your back and shoulders will sit back, okay? Your chest will naturally be strong, your lower back, will work that as well, because everything is tight, everything is holding together, which means everything is going to be a lot more connected, which means it's gonna be stronger, which means you're gonna stand and walk that little bit taller. You can grow an inch that little bit more by working your core, by working that plank, okay? And lastly, number five, improve your balance. Now, you may not know this, but everything in your core is based around your balance. So the stronger your core is, the better it is for you, whether you're playing sport, whether you're working with the children, whether you are doing what work, or picking up boxes and moving around, the better your core is, the better your balance will be. So those of you that do yoga know vastly how important your core is. And those are my five tips. So five reasons to plank. Flatten your stomach, reduce risk of injury, an exercise you can do anywhere, improve your posture, and improve your balance as well. So go and do your planks today. So here's my challenge, guys. Proper planks. Okay, I'm gonna do another video on how to plank correctly a little bit later on, but proper planks, plank challenge, get your friends to take photos, let's do this. Have a fantastic day everybody.